What's up guys, my name is Tech Number here for Troubleshoot and today I've got another super easy fix for a common Counter-Strike error. So opening up Counter-Strike over here and joining a server of any kind. Let's go ahead and join the Behop server. You'll see we're connecting, connecting, booted back to the main menu with the error missing maps, a bunch of code, Behop jxcsgo.bsp. This could of course be any map, including official maps, but we'll get into that later. This one's more just for custom maps. What exactly do you do when you see this? Well, first of all, if it's a friend hosting the server and you join through a lobby, then make sure to subscribe to the same map that they subscribe to on the workshop. Otherwise, if you're joining a public server that's listed on the public list, then what we need to do is go ahead and make note of this map name over here. Then we'll head across to Steam and inside of Steam, we'll find Counter-Strike, right-click Properties, Local Files, Browse Local Files. Then when this window opens up, we'll head into CSGO followed by Maps. Then when we're in here, we'll go ahead and have a look for that map name. So, so it was bhopjxcsgo.bsp. And having a look at the folder, we have bhopjxcsgo.bsp.bz2. Of course, if you don't see file extensions, head across to view and make sure file name extensions is checked. What we'll do is we'll simply select all of the ones that match this name. So I'd highly recommend either sorting by date or sorting by name and finding it. So bhopjxcsgo.bsp.bz2. If there's a bz2 file, make sure to select that. If there's a bsp file as well that doesn't have bz2 after it with the same name, make sure to select that one as well. And of course, if there's one ending in .nav, .nav, make sure to select that one as well. So usually there'll be up to three of these files. Basically, select them, press delete, and hit enter. Then once the map is deleted, simply head back into Counter-Strike, ignore the error, and we'll see if we can reconnect to the server. So of course, if it's a big download, well, then you'll have to wait around for a couple of seconds. However, usually at this point, you'll be able to connect and play. Assuming that you got the error again, make sure that the files are completely deleted out of maps. So whatever ones were matching that name, select them all and then delete them. Then close Counter-Strike completely, start it up again and try to rejoin that same server. At this point, it should be working. However, if it's still not and you're still having issues, the server may be having issues with their fast DL server. What exactly do you need to do? Well, it's actually pretty simple. When in game, simply open up your console with the tilde key as long as you have this enabled within the settings and you should see a bunch of green lines. So downloading from the server's URL slash maps and then the name of the bz2 file. Basically, bsp is the name of the map file format. bz2 is a compressed version of that. And we normally have a nav as well. So what you're going to need to do is select the first one, which is hopefully a bz2. Right click copy, then head across to a browser of your choice and simply paste in the address and we'll let the map download. Then we'll also go ahead, head back into CS, and we'll check the next few green lines looking for a .nav file. I'd again recommend downloading the one ending in bz2, as this is the compressed version and often saves tons of space. For example, a bz2 file may be 30 megs, but the actual map file itself may be 300. That's the level of saving that we're talking. Either way, paste it in and download the nav file as well. Of course, if it doesn't exist, well, that's fine. This map probably doesn't support bots anyways. Otherwise, if you know it does support bots, then make sure to download the .nav without the BSP after it. Then go ahead and open up your downloads folder. So over here, I have the Behop JX CSGO BSP BZ2, and I'll open it up with 7zip. If you don't have 7zip already, it'll be linked in the description down below. Inside of it, you'll see a .bsp, and this is the actual map file. You can open it up and explore some of the materials, etc., etc. But of course, we don't want to do that. Just make sure you have the .bsp selected. Simply drag and drop it out into your maps folder and replace one if it's existing already. There, we've now manually downloaded the map file and extracted it. If you see the map file that you're looking for ending in .bz2, make sure to delete that as that's probably a corrupt or partial download that CSGO might try to use and it might crash out with that same error. Either way, once you have the map, .bsp, and possibly a .nav if the map needs it, then go ahead and start up CS from scratch. I didn't close mine, but I'd recommend closing yours after these steps and trying to rejoin the server. After you've done all of that, you should be able to pick a team and continue as usual. Then if it was an official map that failed to join and gave you that error on an official competitive server or even a casual server, First of all, make sure that you have CSGO properly installed. Head across to the directory, go to CSGO maps, 
find the map name, i.e. DE cache, DE overpass, vertigo, etc, etc. Find them, delete them as well as their .nav files, and then head back into Steam. Right-click on CSGO, Properties. Head across to the Local Files tab and click Verify Integrity of Game Files. It'll then run through all of the files and download the missing ones, hopefully fixing your game. Anyways, that's about it. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Sick Number here for Troubleshoot. Hopefully this video helped you. And I'll see you all next time. Ciao.